What is up? Um, hi. <laughs> uh, I just had to restart this video because the phone the phone rang uh, a couple minutes into my last one, so I'm kind of lost for words, I guess. Um, any of you guys that follow me on my personal Facebook page, which I don't let um, a lot of people um, in the, in the collecting world, unless we are friends. Um, be friends on my Facebook page just because I post personal pictures and Navy stuff and all that stuff like that. But if you are friends with me, and I know a couple of you guys are, um, you know me and my wife had a baby um, yesterday on the 15th, like at 3 in the morning. Um, so, needless to say, I have not been very active <laughs> in any Facebooks or communities or any crap like that. And, and I probably will not be over the next five or six days depending on how my wife feels and, and all that because they give us um, about 10 days off um, to be with our spouses to take care of them and all that good stuff and she's going to need it because she had a c-section so um, it's a little extra length, lengthy recovery there um, but one thing I did do yesterday while I was sitting in the hospital was I, I read some of y'all's comments probably on like my last three videos and I want to thank you guys um, so much. I love the comments. Um, I may not reply to them right away, but I do reply to them. Um, I try to reply to every single one. Um, and I try to answer the questions and all that in the PMs. So um, keep it up, man. Um, I, I thoroughly enjoy um, reading the comments, knowing what y'all enjoyed and what you maybe didn't enjoy. Um, any memories or, or stories you might have had of a particular player um, card that I got or, or so on and so forth um, so I still have a couple more I need to reply to which hopefully I'll do that tonight and uh, yeah we'll go from there um, let's see let's see um, I guess I'll get right into this stuff um, I sent to Ryan Sandberg like I do every year and like every year he sends the same thing back um, but this year it looks different it actually looks signed this year and not pre-printed um, we'll see if my camera will focus. Well, it's not focusing very well, but over that cross letter, that's a streak right there. And I know a lot of preprints don't streak because it's a printer. Um, so if any of you guys have gotten this back, um, please let me know, man. Let me know if this is real or not real. I mean, it looks real as hell to me. I mean, you can see stopping points and everything. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to say he may not have signed this sucker, but someone signed this damn card. <laughs> um, um, I keep looking at my phone, seeing if my wife texts me, because I came home just for a couple minutes. Well, like 30, 40 minutes to get a shower and run a quick load of laundry. So that's why you all see me keep looking over. Uh, let's see. Um, man, I got stuff here from the past couple days. Um, Janet Guthrie, um, first woman to complete the Daytona 500. She signed that for me. Very nice. Terry Lynch of the Twins. I sent him this for the Dunruss set I'm kind of working on from time to time when I get bored. And he sent me that just for S's and G's. Shit's okay. Um, David Murphy, I haven't sent to him in a couple seasons, and I've been meaning to send these two cards to him, and I just haven't done it, um, but he sent them both back to me signed, and I really, really like this one. I'd really like it even more if my camera would focus. <laughs> but, um, yeah, there's that. And then I sent to this dude again, because he's in the um, Press Pass Legend set, Tom, or excuse me, Tiger Tom Pestrone. He signed the card and pen up top. I don't know, wants to focus. And then kind of weird, he did this last time I sent to him. Um, he sent me three um, cards that he signed. And, this, I mean, I got all these back before, so I mean, if anyone wants them, I mean, I guess I can just send them to you. But this is kind of weird, man. Yeah, what's up with that? What's up with the tiger? So, um, I know last time I wrote, someone was joking about baby porn. Um, 
kind of weird, man, when you um, are into the TTM hobby and you get a picture of like a naked baby on a bear rug autographed by the dude who's naked on the bear rug in the photo. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it's kind of kind of different. Xavier, I got a, Xavier Hernandez. I've been getting, I've got him like three times in the past couple months. Uh, this will be the last time for a long time. Um, but the signature does not look familiar. It doesn't look like the last signature I got, like at all. Um, so I got to do a little bit of research. Um, Dave Marcus for the legend set. And let's see what else we got here. Okay, the last four are pretty nice. Um, I got this dude a bunch of times in the past. I sent him a gold sharpie, so he signed his little um, decoy that he always sends to people, and sharp and and my gold sharpie. So that should let you know um, any of you guys that ever had doubts that have gotten Bobby Allison, if um, these are pre-printed or not. Obviously they're not because I sent him a gold sharpie and he signed it with a gold sharpie. Um, so that's that. But he sent this back. Um, I asked him to inscribe it, Hall of Fame 2011. And he did. It's kind of hard to see because of the card. Um, yeah, there you go. With the, it shows up in the glare better than not. And then on the back, he signed the Legends card. Let me find that glare again. But, anyways, he signed it, um, Hall of Fame 2011, as well. Got Junior Johnson back today in the mail. Used my gold sharpie as well. And then, I don't know if these NASCAR guys just never get donations for anything. Because I've sent, I sent a $5 bill to every single one of these guys that I sent these to. Because I wanted them all to write Hall of Fame. And I wanted them all to use my gold marker. Um, well, most of them freaking sign the money and send it back to me. Uh, but I don't get it. I write in the letter clearly. I state that, hey, this is a donation. Please, you know, do blah, blah, blah. So, and they, um, someone, it wasn't Mr. Johnson, but someone wrote me back a letter with this card. And I guess in my letter, I wrote, will you please sign my cards with an S? And they were, there's, there, Garrett, there was only one card in here. But I signed your five dollar, or he, Mr. Johnson signed your five dollar bill and sent it back to you. So, thank you, I guess. Um, I mean, that's just gonna end up going back to my wallet. But I mean, I appreciate it. I wish he would have kept it, but that's fine. And then this dude, Mr. Leonard Wood, um, I still have cards out for him, like at about 185 days right now that I haven't got back. And I got this one back. I sent to the same address, and I got this one back. I think it was 21 days or so. So he signed that side. And then he signed that. And then Mr. Wood kept my $5, didn't use my gold pen. So I guess you never know what you're going to get huh? when you open a TTM. But that's fine. I'd, I'd rather him sign it how he did sign it than me not get it back at all. Um, I got a, a short little story with this photo. That's Mario Andretti in the middle, or so I thought. Um, I wrote him a letter on this little sticky note right here. Whoop. And I wrote, uh, Mr. Andretti, can you please tell me who the other two guys in this photo are? And they wrote left, Bobby Unser, right, A.J. Foyt. In the middle is Mario's twin brother, Aldo. <laughs> so... It's not him, but he still signed the photo. Um, and so, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I mean, I don't know if Mr. Um, Aldo Andretti is still with us. Um, I'll do some research on that probably in the next week or so. Um, but I don't know. It seems kind of silly to have a, a card that I would try to get signed by the other two guys, or a photo, try to get signed by the other two guys, and... Mario Andretti's not in the photo, but he signed it. So, uh, once again, I'm not complaining. I'm glad he signed it. I'd rather him sign it than not sign it. But it's just kind of funny to me. Um, 
And then, last but not least, I'm going to have to make this quick because that's my wife. Um, Tony Stewart from the Press Pass that I'm working on. And man, this one's a flipping beaut, dude. So that one is awesome. So, that's that, guys. Until next time, um, peace out. Write your comments down below if you would like. I'll get back to you, and I'll be watching your videos. Adios.